Well, that's really the unique role that we play in the club industry. We help clubs define their long-range plans, create architectural solutions, conceptual solutions. Interestingly enough, we're not there to be their end product architect when they're actually building the uh, uh, building that work there. That's going to happen in the local area, and that's going to happen for the for the club. Uh, for us, we we put those concepts together, and again, from a, a, a thorough process of having researched what those uh, what those projects should be having interviewed the membership, um, met with the membership, uh, gotten feedback from them. When we put those concepts together, we'll actually stand up and put those concepts in front of the membership. And before we go anywhere near a vote, we're gonna give them the opportunity to critique those and give us feedback. So, you know, and sometimes people are criticizing the plans and everything else and wanna see something different, but it's their club. And ultimately they have the say there about what's gonna happen with that. So. Uh, our conceptual designs then are a way that they can really understand what could happen with their club, uh, what the changes will be, but we put all that together with the notion of the, the rationale. Why is this happening? Why should it happen at our club? Uh, what kind of deficiencies and problems that we have today that we have to solve? What's the new project going to provide for them? And most importantly, how much does it cost and how, much, how, how are we going to pay for it? Those are all things that they're going to want to know. And so we get projects approved because we can take them through that step-by-step -step basis. They really have knowledge. It's very clear to them at the end of the day why we should be doing this, what the implications are for them, what we think the opportunities are for the club. All that builds support and makes them feel that it's, it, it's really the right answer.